This is such a tragedy. The beloved actor Williams was considered a Hollywood treasure. His death in that motorcycle accident near his home in Vermont, a shock to his family, his friends, and his fans. In a shocking and devastating loss, fans mourn the sudden passing of Treat Williams at the age of 71 after a motorcycle crash in Vermont. Treat Williams made an impact on the entertainment industry as one of the most alluring and dependable character actors in the business. He was well known for his iconic father roles in adored series like Everwood and Chesapeake Shores, but during his distinguished career, he bravely accepted many characters from different genres. But before delving into some of the most heart-wrenching reactions from people across the network, a few eyewitnesses who actually happened to see the crash, and of course some heartfelt reactions from his close friends and family, let's take a quick glimpse into some of William's most noted roles. It's safe to say that Treat Williams took us on an incredible ride for six seasons in the fan-favorite series, Chesapeake Shores. As the head of the O'Brien family, Treat brought wisdom, strength, and a whole lot of love to the screen. From heartwarming family moments to nail-biting challenges, Treat's versatile acting skills had us laughing, crying, and emotions of all the feels. He breathed life into his character, making us fall in love with the O'Brien clan and their charming Chesapeake Shores. But Treat's impact wasn't limited to the screen. Behind the scenes, he cultivated a friendly atmosphere that transformed the set into a sizable family reunion. The opportunity to work with such a gifted and sincere star was treasured by all. And the best part is the entire experience was made unique by Treat's love for his work and commitment to the other members of the cast and crew. He was so cool, and I don't think anyone would disagree with me. Fans of Chesapeake Shores experienced a mixture of appreciation and longing as the show's final season came to an end thanks to Treat Williams and his cherished character. In an interview for the last season, he expressed how much he loved the whole storyline and the set of Chesapeake Shores. I can't wait to go to work today <laughs> and put this stuff on film. So it was joyous no matter how, you know, how emotional it was or how, you know, if we went in, we were weeping profusely. It didn't matter because we were doing really good stuff. So let's raise a glass to Williams and his incredible six season adventure on Chesapeake Shores. Williams, you've earned your place in TV history and you will always remain a legend. But well, well, that's not it. He has done more than that. Remember Bill Mitchell, the patriarch of Hallmark's The Christmas House franchise? This was a standout role in Williams' impressive body of work. His six seasons on Chesapeake Shores greatly benefited the network, but it was The Christmas House's groundbreaking 2020 release that truly stood out. Reflecting on Williams's contributions, Bill Mitchell's portrayal deserves special recognition. Over time, Hallmark holiday movies have become beloved cultural fixtures across the globe, engaging audiences everywhere. A commercial exhibiting a same-sex couple, coupled with the resignation of network executive Bill Abbott, kindled extensive societal dialogue. Amid this atmosphere, the Christmas house emerged, serving as a beacon of inclusivity and advancement. And for sure, Hallmark made a significant stride with The Christmas House, marking the first time a holiday movie starred a same-sex couple. The character Bill Mitchell, the devoted dad, was played by Williams. The story centered around Brandon and Jake's adoption venture, embodying a father figure who showed unconditional love and support for his sons, regardless of their sexual orientation. Sadly, these affirmations are frequently denied to real-life gay couples. Williams added authenticity and depth to the role of Bill. So, the cherished annual edition of The Christmas House to Hallmark's holiday lineup has offered viewers comfort and joy ever since hitting screens in 2020. Though the challenges faced by the LGBTQ community couldn't be ignored, the movie prevailed in spreading holiday cheer, and Williams, with his eternal charm, lit up the screens with his depiction of an exemplary father, tenderly accepting his gay offspring. His presence in these films carried profound significance, reminding us of the love and acceptance we all yearn for. Other famous feature films include Journey to the Center of the Earth, Rocky Mountain Christmas, The Christmas House. Here's a small glimpse to the most thrilling movie, Journey to the Center of the Earth. Casper, my husband, has been missing for seven years, and I would like you to find him. <laughs> Madam, I, I'm a scientist, not a detective. This movie was literally loved by everyone, but... Let's say goodbye to our true legend as his legacy lives on through his unforgettable performances and the lasting impact he made on the industry. His contributions to Hallmark's inclusive storytelling will continue to inspire generations and remind us of the power of entertainment to reflect and shape the world we seek to create. Now let's get into the depths of the incident that left all of us shocked. According to Jacob Gribble, the fire chief of Dorset, Vermont, the terrible crash occurred on Monday, June 12th, around 5 p.m. on Route 30, near Dorset's Long Trail Auto. He stated that the accident involved a car, 
and treat Williams' motorcycle. In a shocking turn of events, Vermont resident Matt Rapon found himself at the scene of the motorcycle accident that claimed the life of the beloved actor. Rapon, the owner of Long Trail Auto in East Dorset, was one of the eyewitnesses to the harrowing crash that unfolded along the route. Apparently, the impact catapulted Williams approximately 15 feet from his 1983 Honda VT700C after he was struck by a 2008 Honda Element. With the actor wearing a helmet, it was difficult to immediately recognize him, but the driver, who knew Williams personally, exclaimed, Oh my God, it's Treat! When emergency services arrived, Williams is said to have been conscious and responsive. The paramedics who attended to him asked him several questions while he lay in pain. As they carefully transferred him onto a backboard before placing him on a stretcher and into the ambulance, the ambulance then raced away from the scene, transporting Williams to a hospital in Albany, New York, as he battled critical injuries. Tragically, despite all efforts to save him, Williams succumbed to his injuries and was soon pronounced dead. It was Barry McPherson, Williams's agent of 15 years, who then shared the devastating news with people, expressing his profound grief. He described Williams as the kindest soul, and went on to explain how devastated he was by the loss of an incredibly talented individual. Several countless locals who had the pleasure of knowing Williams, and of course Rapon as well, were shattered by the actor's untimely demise. The Vermonter remembered him as a funny and good-natured individual who effortlessly connected with people, despite his fame. Reflecting on their interactions, Rapon reminisced about Williams's down-to-earth nature and genuine interest in others. Sadly, this tragic accident that claimed William's life serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of existence. As we mourn the loss of a cherished actor, let us remember his warmth, talent, and the impact he had on the lives of those he encountered. It's hard to imagine what his family must be going through during these tough times. Eleanor Williams, who is the daughter of the late actor Treat Williams, shared her emotions surrounding her father's devastating death in an Instagram story which was posted on June 16th, where she expressed the profound pain she was experiencing. She stated, and I quote, This is a pain I have never felt. I am absolutely shattered. She also expressed gratitude to everyone who has sent messages of support and kept her family in their thoughts during this heartbreaking time. As we all know, the sudden passing of Williams also sent shockwaves through not only Hollywood, but also among the fellow celebrities who had the privilege of working alongside him on the beloved Hallmark Channel. The outpouring of love and admiration on social media is a testament to Treat's profound impact on those around him. One of his co-star Jonathan Bennett in the heartwarming film The Christmas House took to Instagram to express his sorrow, commenting on a news story about Treat's passing. Sharon Lawrence, Another co-star from The Christmas House shared a touching tribute on Twitter, capturing the essence of Treat's vibrant spirit. She described their time together as an exhilarating adventure and expressed her shock and heartache over the loss. Sharon praised Treat's remarkable qualities, his zest for life, unwavering devotion to family and passions, and his ability to create a beautiful existence filled with love. She acknowledged the profound grief felt by his loved ones, but found solace in the incredible memories they shared and the fact that Treat pursued his passions until the end. Her poignant words remind us all to soar high in honor of Treat's memory. Trevor Donovan offered his condolences to the family, saying, I'm really sorry to hear about Treat Williams's passing. My thoughts and condolences go out to his family during this tough time. I hope they can find comfort and strength in the memories they hold dear and the love they shared. Other stars from the Hallmark Channel family joined in on the chorus of condolences. Andrew Francis, known for his role in Chesapeake Shores, bid farewell to Treat with a poignant message, referring to him as family and urging him to fly like the wind. Jessica Sipos, another cast member from Chesapeake Shores, expressed her everlasting love for Treat, while Beverly Mitchell conveyed her deep sadness and emphasized how much Treat was missed by all. Nia Long, who had the pleasure of working with Treat, described him as one of the loveliest humans she'd ever encountered, highlighting his genuine character. Outside the Hallmark Channel realm, influential figures from the entertainment industry also shared their memories of Treat. Rosie O'Donnell fondly recalled their connection by mentioning Claude Hooper Bukowski, a character Treat portrayed. Patty Stanger, who met Treat during his time at Hallmark, expressed her sorrow and described him as the loveliest man she had encountered. Wendell Pierce, who worked with Treat on a film, reminisced about their friendship and Treat's infectious, adventurous spirit. Though not having had the opportunity to collaborate with Treat, Lou Diamond Phillips remembered him as a kind and generous soul whose warmth and grace radiated alongside his immense talent. Justine Bateman, who shared the stage with Treat in a Mammoth production, mourned her dear friend's loss, 
emphasizing his profound impact on her life. James Woods, who spent months alongside Treat during the filming of Once Upon a Time in America, cherished the resilient good cheer and sense of humor Treat brought to their time together. James expressed his deep love for Treat and conveyed his devastation over the loss. As the entertainment industry mourns the passing of Treat Williams, the legacy he leaves behind is one of remarkable talent, infectious spirit, and unwavering kindness. The heartfelt tributes from his fellow celebrities paint a picture of a man who touched lives and left an indelible mark on all who had the privilege of knowing him. Treat Williams will forever be remembered as a beloved star whose memory will continue to shine brightly in the hearts of those he inspired. As the curtain falls on Treat Williams' remarkable journey, a symphony of heartfelt tributes resounds throughout the entertainment world. May his spirit of adventure and love for life inspire us to reach for the stars and create our own extraordinary stories. Farewell, Treat Williams, your final bow echoes in our souls. Before you leave, let us know which is your favorite Treat Williams movie. And if you enjoyed our content, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And be sure to check out our newest merchandise available now, especially you Tyler Hines fans. Thanks for watching, everyone.